Yeah, always going on guys, it's JD here back with episode 14 of Path to Pink Diamond. Now today, as you can see on your screens, we are one win away from promotion from the Amethyst League. So we're getting close towards our second prestige now. We've got two games left if we don't get it today, but hopefully we should be able to get a W today. We're in really good form at the moment, and as you can see, our opponent has a pretty solid team actually. It's got Amethyst Boogie Cousins, the Kobe and the Steve Francis, who is just still one of the best players in the game. Anyway, we start the game off here. We're looking for our first points two minutes in. KD with a wide open tray doesn't get it, but poor Zingis is there to slam it down. Now, this was a tough game, especially to start out with. As you can see, with three, well, two and a half minutes in, Manute Bowl is standing off the court, which is great. But yeah, with two and a half minutes in, only two points have been scored. So we were both really struggling on offense. This guy hadn't realized that Manute Bowl owns the paint. <laughs> like, Manute Bowl is so good in this game, it's ridiculous. But. Anyway, this guy hadn't realised yet, and Paul Zingas as well, with his height, he is just deadly in this game. So moving on, this guy is still coming into the paint, that's a dreadful shot, I mean, with Amethyst Boogie even still, that ain't going in, but it's alright, because Manute Bowl was there, and who's here on the glass? It's Manute Bowl, <laughs> 6 points out of our 10 to start this game off came from the big fella. And then Giannis, there's going to be quite a lot of highlights from him today, the old Greek freak showing his speed. Gets a breakaway slam there, and then gets the steal and another slam. That is how you do it. Four points in like five seconds. It's too easy. And then Larry Johnson thinking he's just seen what Giannis has done. So he thinks, you know what, I'm going to get some easy points as well. If people can't inbound the ball, that's not my fault. <laughs> like I'm going to take easy points any day of the week. So we do take quite a nice lead early on here. We're up by 11. Steve Francis. Oh my god. <laughs> Enjoy that poster. God, what a dunk that was. And then Steve Francis here at the buzzer. He gets it in. So gives us a 15 point lead at the end of the first. This guy scored 7 points in an entire quarter. And yeah, he, was, he wasn't the best opponent. He was chucking up shots like that Kobe one there. He just couldn't do anything on defense either. And we've run a nice play for Kyrie, which gets him a wide open tray at the top of the key. And then here we go with Steph. Steph's dancing. This is why he's the best point guard in the game. Fading away three. Timing very late. It doesn't matter. It's Steph Curry. It's going down. And then look at this for a block. Poor Zingis rises to the sky to get that one down. And then here we go with some nice ball movement. KD. We know there's a man wide open. It's Kobe. Oh, it's not. It's Larry Johnson. Manute Bolt gets it though, LJ have another go, mess up the release so badly but somehow that drops in and yeah we're in full control of this game. We run the play again here, he thinks I'm going over, we cut back under and Kevin Willis who has been dropped from my team now but in this game he put in some valuable minutes. So we do leave my opponent wide open for a 3 here, I don't know how. But that actually cuts it to a 9 point game, so my opponent was still sticking in this, but we get some glitchy shit with Giannis there. An F quality shot, which somehow went in. I'm pretty sure I meant it to be a pump fake, but yeah, there we go. And then Paul Zingis gets a nice block at the other end, which leads to a wide open green release 3 from Lou Hudson to get us back in control of this game. So my opponent comes in here, get out of here, Giannis says no, he gets the ball, but we take that back. And we're running with Paul Zingis. We're looking for options. Manute Bowl, the giant, he's in there. Giannis is so good, even with the ball. He can come in and then he can finish like that at the rim. Relentless finisher coming in big time. Will we get a steal there? No, we don't. We get a steal here? No, we don't. So <laughs> he gets so lucky, but it doesn't matter because Sean Bradley's there. He thinks, I haven't had any highlights this game. I'm going to turn up one time. And so is Steve Francis. What a step back that is. Into the three ball. And that puts us up nearly by 20. And then here we go again. Some great defense from Sean Bradley. We're kicking it up. We're running. It's Giannis again on the fast break. Another contact layup, which he knocked in. And here we go with Sean Bradley. What a block that is from behind. A nasty chase down block. And Sean Bradley is not done there. So Kyrie, we're going to get it to him off the inbounds. We're going to see Sean Bradley under the basket where he should be. And then he's doing well. And there he is again, straight there. And that's a tough finish. Doesn't matter for Sean, he gets it. That's six points and five boards off the bench, which is solid for Sean. And then Sean's not done. <laughs> I feel like all I've done is say Sean Bradley. But here we go again. It's back to Sean Bradley. It's in again. <laughs> the guy is so good. He's too tall. And that is all she wrote. 